I'm John Lithgow, and this is my friend Jeff Bridges. We're doing the Wired Autocomplete uh, a Shenanigans. I'm afraid to Google myself. I, mean, I don't want to see that. I mean, I want to see that, but I don't want to see that. Oh, here we go. Okay. Oh, this is oh, great. Okay. What was Jeff Bridges' first movie? Oh, The Company She Keeps. Oh, six me? months old. Oh, six months old. Six months old. I'll tell you the story. I probably already did, but you forgot, you mm -hmm. know, because you're an old man. Yeah, I'm an old man. That's yeah. Right. Uh, hit me again. What do Jeff Bridges' grandchildren call him? Oh, well, say I wanted them to call me Dude Pa. Dude Pa. But they've shortened it now to just Doody. Uh, I hope it's Howdy Doody uh, and not Dog Doody. Uh, that you're but you know to. they're kids. You know which one uh, they're going to pick. What did Jeff Bridges win an Oscar for? That's a no-brainer. Uh, crazy Heart. <laughs> yeah. I'm awfully glad you didn't forget uh, oh, that. Oh, I could have easily. I could have. What camera? Does Jeff Wide Bridges? Yes, okay. Wide lock. There it is. And there I'm going to do a little pitching now. My wife Susan and I are creating a new a Wide Lux because the old factory's burned down. Yeah, and they take incredible pictures, oh. three or four of which feature me as the old man's friend John. Uh, Sue. My wife gave me one as a, a first anniversary present, oh. and that's about the only one I used. And that now. was 47 years ago? Yeah, mm. that's some merits a good wow. thing. Nice. Oh what have I done? Okay, let's see how you do. All right, okay, this will be fun. Where did John Lisko grow up? Ah, well, I'm still growing up. I'm still trying to make it to maturity, but I was born in Rochester, New York, by age two, I was living in Yellow Springs, Ohio. By sixth grade, I was living in, oh my God, Stockbridge, Massachusetts, Waterville, Ohio, Oak Bluffs, Massachusetts, Man, Akron, you Ohio. Moved around we a lot. Know, a lot of, I, I finished high school in Princeton, New Jersey. Who is John Lisko in Shrek? Ah, Lord Farquaad. <laughs> oh, I, I always, see, and people used to ask me, you know, is there any part you couldn't play? I said, well, I'll never play anyone short. And then along came hey, Lord Farquaad. There you go. See? See? Yeah. What, what I shouldn't. season ah. of Dexter is John Lithgow in? In. He's a season out. four yeah. recognized the world around as the scariest, mainly because of the Trinity Killer. That was me. But I'm, I'm not really like that. I love playing villains. You know, uh, I'm a well-known nice guy, which makes it all the better to play villains. I'm the last person you'd suspect. John Lithgow uh -huh. in Footloose. Was John Lithgow in Footloose? I was in the original Footloose. In, in the Riv remake, I was played by Dennis Quaid or my part was. Uh -huh. But yes, the answer is yes. Footloose, 40 years old this year. And would you please stand on the box and do a little footloosing? Footloose, put on your Sunday shoes or whatever it is to post. Go ahead, Reds. Put on the fan my knees, fees, plumbies. Is that the, I, I, I've lost no, both the words and no, the steps. No, I don't think so. I've well, lost that, a few that was, steps. That was... I, Kevin Bacon would have done much better than I. I like, oh, I, God, I this like, goes on and on. Oh, I like, be, I like being the on interlocutor. You, you like this guy. Okay. Does Jeff Bridges play guitar in Crazy Heart? Yeah, I do. It's always I like in his trailer. Guitar, that's right. Okay, does Jeff Bridges... Surf. Oh, I do. do I, haven't, I have in the last 10 years. You never told but, me about your surfing history. Oh, yeah, history. man. Oh, yeah. yeah <laughs> well, let's have another yeah. one. Okay. Does Jeff Bridges have tattoos? And you never tell. You've decided no, to, uh, you're yeah. pleading the fifth. Actually, beneath my hair, John. No. Yes, I have sort of doll hair tattooed all over my head. Every once in a while I shave my head and I just... And you have doll hair under I that? doll, yeah, it's tattooed on my hair, very tight curls. Wow. Oh, does well, Jeff Bridges have dogs? I do, Monty. He's a cavapoo, mm -hmm. half cavalier King Charles and half poodle. Well, that's it okay. for me. How oh, about it? another one? 
look at the pile they got oh for us, God. John. But this okay. is fun. I'm having yeah, a Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, we get to hang. I and thought I would freeze up. Yeah, yeah. Prepare to freeze, John. Okay. Because this is a toughie. I want to be stumped. When did John Disco start acting? Ah. <laughs> My first role was when I was two years old. I played my father's son in Ibsen's Doll's House. I, I was just two. My older sister was also in the play. I don't remember a thing about it, but I'm told I was very good. <laughs> and that apparently was the beginning of my career. There you go. Yeah. Okay, is John Lithgow nice? Oh, is, is, is John well, Lithgow nice? that's not for me to say, of course. Uh, that, that subject comes up a lot because people say I'm very nice, uh, but it's only because uh, it's I, an love, act. It's I an act, love. Man, come on, of course it's an act. But yes. but I actually, in all reality, I love all the people I work with, and I see the our business as <clears throat> we're all in this together. Amen. And I think Amen. if you live by those watchwords, people think you're nice. There you go. It's very easy oh, to fool. That's true. That's a good answer. How is John Lisko related to Brad Pitt? Not remotely. <laughs> I, I will tell you my history with him, though. It's quite mm -hmm. a beautiful thing. Uh, I had friends whose daughter had a very, very serious illness that required her to be in in the hospital at UCLA mm. for, for a couple of months. And she learned that Brad came in once a week to the same ward to have a, 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 a wrist ailment taken care of. And she wrote me asking him, who I did not at all, know at all, if he would just come and say hi to her one day. And so I, I wrote Brad Pitt a letter and told him that circumstance, never heard back from him. I heard back from her. The next week, he had gone in there to her ward room with all her girlfriends, and he'd spent two mm -hmm. hours with those kids. Well, you know, sign, photographs, talk, just talk, making her feel better. He sounds nice. He sounds real nice. Who does John Lithgow play in The Crown? Ah, oh, that's an easy I one. played Winston Churchill yes. in The Crown, and this gives me the opportunity to give you my very favorite Winston Churchill oh, quote. Oh, Everybody good. knows the familiar good ones. One. A woman came up to him at a big, fancy reception and pointed out to him that his fly buttons were undone, and Churchill's response was, it's not a problem. A dead bird never leaves its nest. <laughs> and that's it for you, John, no. this round. Okay, all right. Actually, I could have okay. used that line when I that's snipped right. the thread that's off right. my crotch. Okay. Yeah, it's my turn. Okay, your I, like, turn. I like this part better. Okay. okay. Jeff Bridges, Jeff Bridges' eyes. What does that mean? All right. I think you've just answered the question. That's it. That's what they wanted to see. Do it for the camera. That's the dude's My eyes. Mom would call this, make sweet eyes and I do this. Yeah. Okay, but we have to move on to an actual <laughs> question. Here we go. <laughs> Jeff Bridges, the big Lebowski. What's well, supposed to happen here? There's no, it's not a question. Not a question. Everybody knows you're the big Lebowski. Yeah, yeah the dude, man. I don't know what to say. Just, okay, be it. the dude. Is the dude the thing that people most yes. recognize you for? Yes, yeah, absolutely. I would and they'll so. throw out some different, uh, yeah. you know, quotes from the show. You know, the dude abides, you know. Exactly. Shut the fuck up, Donnie. And one more. <laughs> <laughs> One more. That's just like your opinion, man. <laughs> okay, Jeff Bridges, Hell or High Water. David McKenzie, great director. Taylor Sheridan, wonderful script. Okay, well, let, let me ask you this. Which do you prefer? Hell or high water? <laughs> <laughs> they both have qualities that I enjoy. <laughs> okay, tell me about the Jeff Bridges Band. The Jeff Bridges Band... It's called The Abiders. We had a wonderful time. I had my, my Beatle moment mm -hmm. uh, playing the uh, Lebowski Fest to a sea of dudes. 
God. And I was, oh, you know. Oh, so, wonderful. Oh, it was so Where great did moment. that take place? Thank you, right. Lebowski and, and, festivals? And, yeah, they last yeah. for days. And it's pretty wild. Yeah, uh, you have unleashed a monster. And, you know, people like to dress up. And you got bowling pins and you got mods and dudes. Do people show up as Torturo or Good Oh, or yeah. Or oh, that's then, very common. I want to be at one of these. Well, we'll go together. Yeah. What would you dress up as? Julianne Moore. Yes, the Viking <laughs> helmet. Viking yeah, helmet, yes. yes absolutely. be great. Okay, Jeff Bridges, oh, John Lithgow. Tell me what you think of John Lithgow. John Lithgow is very nice. <laughs> He's a charming man. <laughs> so well-educated, a lovely actor, and uh, He's fun. Oh, good. He's fun. I, I, <laughs> I love you, man. I love you, yes. dude. Yes. <laughs> you are the greatest. <laughs> you know? Okay. Lightning round. Quick, John Lithgow. Okay. Just say quick. Yeah, okay. Okay. Just <clears> throat> throat> one word. Oh, John my Lithgow. God. I'm gorgeous. John Lithgow, voice of Yoda. <clears throat> oh. Impatient is he? And next John the old man. John the old man. Oh my God! I've forgotten all my lines. Very good. <laughs> it's it's John much Lithgow. It's, kids books. <laughs> oh, oh yes. Uh, uh, never play music right next to the zoo. John Lithgow storyline. Google it. Oh children, remember whatever you may do. Never play music right next to the zoo. They'll burst from their cages, each beast and each bird, desperate to play all the music they've heard. The lions and the elephants, the bears and the raccoons, will steal away the trumpets, the flutes and bassoons, replace the musicians and chase them away. Then they'll sit in the band shell and play. Yeah! yeah. yeah. What, yeah. An what, what an ending! What an ending! What an ending!